Hi, this is Shane, and welcome back to another episode of Autonaton. And um, last week I was ill, so I couldn't really do anything. I sounded really bad. <laughs> I couldn't even record. So um, thanks to everybody for all the well wishes and get well soons and stuff. That really meant a lot to me. And um, yeah, I didn't think I'd miss recording, but I have. <laughs> so um, we're back. Last week, not last week, week before, in the last episode, we put together the super super energy cell thing. I can't remember the name of it off the top of my head, but I've hooked it up to um, our power source and I've left it soaking up some energy so we can go outside. I've also moved it so it was a little bit closer to the um, to the power source. So let's go outside and have a look. We got anything outside? Where are we? No, we're good. I don't think there's any any baddies close by. So I've hooked it up. Twelve energy source. It is filling up very slowly. Very very slowly. What I might do actually is um. I've got more windmills. I might put them up on the roof like these and then I will um, get some more energy going into it. I think I'll have to do that between episodes because it's taken a long time to fill up which is fine but we need a lot of energy to make our void ore resource mine not ore Void ore miner. The resource miner is something different. You have the ore miner, you have the res... Oh, I thought that was a enderman. You have the, the void miner, you've got the resource miner, you have the botanic miner. So that's three different miners. Although, was there four in the quest book? Oh, the solar array. Okay, I've never used the solar array, but I'm guessing you can use that to power the the um the miners. So we can look at that as well. Um I started making stuff for the miners. I've got the structure panels, the interconnects. I've also got the digital guide which helps you put together everything. Uh let me see. We want the ore miner. So it tells you exactly what you need. We want the ore miner tier one. So we need 24 st structure frame blocks tier one, 20 structure panels, no modifiers, two laser cores, and one clear laser lens. Now the lenses, the core and the lenses, I haven't looked at yet, but I made the structure panel which was wasn't too bad uh, i see structure panel you need a connector which is basically redstone and iron and then you also need gold nuggets and iron bars so it's fairly fairly straightforward um the next thing was the structure frame tier one which I haven't made yet. That's why I made the interconnects. Actually, I stopped at that point because I thought I might as well come on and start recording. And I've noticed that my game keeps doing that now. I would delete things from here and it will pop back up again. I'm not sure why it's doing that. I really don't know. Is it going to pop up or is Yep. Okay, let's delete that, escape, but it put it back in, didn't it? Oh no, it's gone now. I don't know why it does that, that is just, it's very strange. Okay, um, structure, structure frame tier one. If I put tier one, tier one. Structure frame tier one. So we need an interconnect, iron nuggets, and lithorite crystals. 
Hopefully we have enough Litherite crystals. No, we don't. Okay, Litherite crystals, I know you can make those. For the for the other things that um you need to make the higher tiers, you have to mine those up, and the ore miner will mine it up. But for this first tier with the Litherite crystal, you can make that. So let's let me see. We need a 24 and I think there was two per so that could be we need 48 okay uh nope what have we run out of green dye some kind of green dye don't we have green dye what was in the other corner oh lime okay All right, how do we make lime dye? Uh, green dye and bone meal. Okay. All right, there's a stack of that. That should be fine. Okay, we have eight so far. I said we needed 48, right? Might as well make a stack. That should be more than enough. And we've made one structure tier. I said tier one. Okay. Are you kidding me? Put you there and the interconnects. How much is that all together? That is 18 and we need 24. There you go. All done. Right. So we've got that. We need two laser cores. And I probably should have looked at this before we started. But as usual, I thought, yeah, we're fine. OK, iron intercon no iron connectors and glass. We should be fine with that. So we have two laser cores and clear light, clear laser lens it's that we need any glass okay that's pretty simple let's put everything else away the only thing let me see put that away and the cables no well yeah um all right the wind we will need the the generators those we can put away for now okay the only other thing is that we need line of sight down to bedrock so we need to decide where we're going to put it and then like a noob dig straight down to bedrock which should be fun um yeah so where are we going to put because actually you need something that will give us enough space so we can expand because um it starts off quite small and then it gets huge that is the only thing so if we go here and go up in the up in the air i will make one miner and then I might make the others just to um to unlock that tab or to see if there's anything else to unlock but I don't know if I want to go through making them all because like um what did we do like the woot um where was it where did we have overcome your enemies like the woot stuff it is all very much rinse and repeat and I don't know if I really need to do all of that like I said, when you play your game, you can decide whether you want all the all the layers or not. But I don't really think we need it. So I think we will dig down here. So I need to go up there and make this. Okay. I don't know if this has the... Oh, it's getting to be night time. 
All right, let's go and sleep first and then start a brand new day with it because oh, we're down here. It doesn't make sense starting now because it's night time and we'll probably get eaten by something or blown up or something. Um, I also need to make sure I have there it is. We need the assembler. All right. Shift for in info. Okay. Nothing of interest. Just telling you where to look in JEI. For the in-game guide. We already know where to find it. No, we don't want to go this way. Thank you. Thank you. No, 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 no. It's like exercise. I don't need to do it. Right, let's sleep. Okay. Um, right, let's build our machine up. And also we need to provide power to it. So it would help if we build it up and then dig down to line of sight. Is that a... Oh, he's in the village. He's always been there. I just caught sight of a villager on the... Um, the mini map but he's always there he's trapped in a house somewhere so he is the he's the only he's the, the survivor of the village okay All right we're gonna do it here let's go up 10 blocks I don't think 10 blocks is enough maybe 12 all right 12 blocks that should be enough and then if I want to um if I want to expand, that should be big enough. Okay, can I... Do I remember how to expand with this? Oh, which one do I put down first? There's something I put down first. Oh, I can't remember. All right, let's see if the digital guide tells us anything. No, nothing on that bit. Uh, must have signed to the void or bedrock. Multi-block position be below the controller. Okay, what's the controller? Oh, the controller is that thing. We didn't make it. All right, I knew we were forgetting something. All right, let's go make the controller. I knew we were forgetting something and I could not remember what that something was. Oh dear. See, when just when I think, yeah, we've got everything sorted, it's not sorted. All right, let's go have a look. And let's go this way. If we bounce, it seems like we're going faster. We may or may not be, I don't know, but it seems like it. All right. Uh, void. Or there's the controller. All right, we need another crystal lens. We need a diode. We need litharite tiles. Right. Um, or, all right, so we need to make more litharite. Uh, litharite paver, litharite. All right, let's see how much we can make. That's one stack. That's two, st uh, not two stacks. We need more lime. I think we can get eight, seven out of this. Okay. All right. I think we have, we have enough. Okay. And void controller. And we want this one, the blue one. Uh, we want a diode, which is glass, redstone and iron. That's easy enough to make. And we are good. Ah, and it's night time again. Only in this game. I swear. Well, the quest is complete. Oh, because it was only to make the controller, isn't it? Ah, oh, okay. Um, environmentally technical. It wants level two, level three. It's going to go all the way down to level six. 
Hmm. Okay. And we get a loot chest. Let's take our loot chest. Let's see if we get anything interesting. Uh, storage upgrades. Not really. Seeing that we don't use that anymore. So that is not of any interest. i put those away. The stake can go away because we don't need that right now. And the block of diamond. But we have everything else. Now, if I remember correctly, we need you need the controller in place and then you keep right clicking with the assembler and that will build your your um your miner. Right, so we were going here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eleven, twelve. I think we should go up two more. Thirteen, fourteen. Right. So I need the controller. But, I th oh, you know what? Alright, anyhow, let's see how this goes. It may may or may not build seeing that this stuff is underneath it but it's building okay okay the only thing that's missing all right this is gonna hurt oh Okay, game, why are you doing that? Okay, so it didn't... It didn't like the fact that we had the dirt underneath it, so it didn't put the lenses. That was the only thing. So we need to go back up. Where's the scaffolding? Why is everything saying progress 46%? This game is getting very glitchy now. I've noticed that. Um, is that... Oh, that is the thing. All right. Let's, um, let's go back down. Ouch. And then... We'll go back on top and finish build it. All right, let's go here. Okay, and the assembler. So we have the lens, the lenses. Yes, they've gone. So that's fine. That's now fully built. Let's see if we can get down without breaking something. Yeah. Um, we'll leave that there for now. Right. Because we need to get back up. And then this is where the fun starts. We start to dig straight down. Okay. I will, I can't do that yet, <laughs> I can't do that yet, I should, I should probably have some, oh I should probably have some um, torches, I don't even know if I, ha oh yes I do have torches, okay, I am not going to be digging straight down with you guys because you have not, you don't want to see me digging. You definitely don't want to see me digging. So what I will do, I will dig down to bedrock and then join you guys um, when I hook up the power. So I will see you in a bit. Okay, I'm back. That was pretty easy. You can see the beam now coming down to bedrock. And as it turned out, I didn't encounter any lava at all. 
and I came down into one of my mine shafts, which is pretty cool. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that at all. And where are we? This way. Hope. Oh, is that a creeper out there? Looks like there's a creeper out here somewhere. Where am I? This way. So yeah, I wasn't expecting that at all. I was expecting to fall into lava. But thankfully that didn't happen. So, um... So yeah, there's a beam that will go straight down. Well, you saw the beam where I was. But that goes straight down to bedrock. So now we just need to power the, um... Oh, but how are we going to power that though? Because when I've played with um, environmental tech before, there's been like an energy cube or something. Some kind of portable energy something. Um, we do have energy cubes. Like wireless energy, but there's no wireless energy option in this. So you can see the um you can see the beam, so you know it's hooked up correctly. Looks a bit like a spaceship to be honest. Yeah, you can see the beam, so you know it's hooked up correctly. Um I don't know. We've got this energy cube here, which is mechanism. So maybe we can hook this up? Maybe we can hook this up. The thing is, I don't know how much... Um, I don't know how much energy it pulls. I've, I've only ever just used it. I don't think this is... Oh, do I have... I don't even have the thing on me. I'm not really prepared, am I? I wanted the ender chest. I should go and eat something. Okay, let's get something to eat. Let's get the ender chest. Let's puzzle out what we're doing in terms of um, energy. Although they have solar arrays, so maybe we should use the solar array. Maybe that's why they have you make they have you make the solar array. Does that sound? That doesn't sound right. But maybe that's why you have to make it. Let's have a look and see. Solar. All right, we need blocks of lapis and blocks of litharite again, and a solar cell okay so solar cells are what does litharite yeah all these other things is what comes up so we're gonna have to make litharite and we need photovoltaic cells which is lapis and quartz all right so for a solar but how does the solar array work I don't even know. All right, next thing. Let's look at this. Home uh, solar arrays. They allow you to ha harness the power of the sun, obviously. Uh, affected by weather will not generate during the night. Okay, so for the solar array, you need 16 structure frame ones nine solar cells and four modifiers hmm okay let's see if we can make if we can hook up what we have what did i come back for i can't remember now i came back for something oh i'm losing it old age is setting in it came down oh the ender chest i knew i'd remember did i put that in my backpack i don't think i did no i didn't 
And the ender chest is not on here. Does this run out of wood? It has. Right, let's get some more. We really have to find a better way of getting our, our um our ores. I know you have mechanism and all the machines and stuff. Maybe we could hook it up to that instead. I don't know. All right, that's that. Let's us end the chest. Shane, you're losing it. Did I put the ender chest in here though? No. What did I hook the ender chest up to? I know I hooked it up to something. Oh, I know where it is. It's outside. Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> Okay, the under chest is outside. Take that in my hand, otherwise I'll keep... Oh, really? Um... Burn. Alright, and you have no presents for me? That's... that's so rude. Alright, let's come over here, was it? Up here. Right, this should have nothing in it. Do I have it? Yes, I do. And let's see. Let's go up. Let's see, I think the chest can go on top. And power can go on the side. Let's put it on that side. Now if we get the energy cube. The only thing is 660. You only know if it's pulling in stuff if, like, if you see stuff going in. Alright, I've come back in for some cable. Because I don't think I put any in my backpack, did I? Yeah, that's not getting any power. I think when you right-click it with the... with the assembler, you get... you get, like, a proper reading. Cable. Uh, advanced, basic, let's go for advanced. It's also advanced, but... Uh, okay, no, it just, because I took out a stack. That's all. Oh. Sometimes I wish my base was smaller, or I had better forward planning skills when it comes to making machines and stuff. But never mind. I can't remember how you hook up. Um, there's nothing coming out of it. Oh, it's all set to input. Oh, there you go. Output. Still saying 660, but is anything coming in? Because it could be coming in very slowly, or it might not be working at all. Oh yeah, there you go. It's bought in stuff. I don't know if you just saw it. I took my eyes off for two seconds, and it came in. It bought in something. I saw it looked like it was copper, or something, something green. 
but it will work very very slowly okay so i'm going to have to run cable down to our machine down there it's gonna look so janky honestly but yeah i'm pretty sure the last time i used this there was like some kind of um some kind of wireless energy all right if i put it's not putting it out so that must be input all right well i'm going to wire this up in the meantime but i think that's it as the sun goes gracefully towards the um the western horizon we've made a um an ore miner it's going to be extremely slow because it has no speed modifiers on it and it's only the first tier there you go you got nether quartz but it works we have power going to it and it's bringing up stuff so thanks very much for watching please like comment and subscribe it really helps to grow my channel and i will see you guys in the next episode okay thanks for watching Bye bye